Exercise six. What's your last name? Listen to the conversations and complete the information about each person. One, Linda. This is Marty. He is from Canada. Nice to meet you. I'm Linda Mandel. I come from Brazil. Ah,、oh, hello. And what's your last name again? Mandel. M A N D E L. What do you study here, Linda? I study business. Two. Hi, I'm Joseph Block from Finland. Please call me Joe. Hello, Joe. What's your last name again? It's Block. B L O C K. What are you studying now? Engineering. Oh, engineering. That sounds interesting. Three. Okay, Miss McClay. Let me just check this information. Is your first name spelled E L L E N? No, my first name is Elena. It's spelled E L E N A. Okay, thanks. And you are from Brazil, correct? No, I'm not from Brazil. I'm from Mexico. Oh, sorry, Mexico. But you are studying English, right? Yes, that's right. Exercise seven: the maps of some countries. Task A: look at the maps of some countries. Listen to the tape and write down the people's names next to the country where they come from. One. All right, Miss He. Let me just check this information. Is your first name spelled S U E? No, it's not. It's spelled S U, no E at the end. It's not an English name. Hmm. Thank you. And you are from Korea, correct? No, I'm not from Korea. I come from Japan. Ah,、uh, I see. Su, so you are Japanese. Two. Hello, Mr. Smith. What's your first name? My first name is Charlie. It's spelled C H A R L I E. C H A R L I E. Okay, Charlie. Do you come from Brazil? No, I don't. I come from Mexico. So you are Mexican? Yes, that's right. Three. Good morning. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like to reserve computer time. Certainly. What's your surname, please? McLean. Could you spell that for me? Yes, it's M A C L A I N. Thank you.、Uh, what's your first name? Shirley. That's spelled S H I R L E Y. Thanks. Where are you from, Ms. McLean? Germany. I see. So your mother tongue is German, isn't it? Yes, that's right. When do you want to use the computer? Next Monday morning, from nine to eleven. Okay, that will be fine. Four. Good afternoon. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like to enroll for the course. Certainly. What's your last name? Beatty. Could you spell that for me? Yes, it's B E A. T T Y. Thanks, Mr. Beatty. And what's your first name? Emilio. That's spelled E M I L I O. Thank you. Where are you from, Mr. Beatty? Italy. I see. So you are Italian. Yes, that's right. Five. Good afternoon. Can I help you? Good afternoon. I'd like to join the tennis club. Certainly. What's your last name? White. Could you spell that for me? Yes, it's W H I T E. Thanks, Mr. White. And what's your first name? Marty. That's spelled M A R T I. Thank you. Where are you from, Mr. White? France. I see. So you speak French. Yes, that's right. Exercise eight. That sounds interesting. Listen to the conversation carefully. Fill in the table below as you listen. 
Steve, who are the two women over there? Oh, their names are Shirley and Linda. Hi, Shirley. This is Anne. She's from Canada. Hello, Shirley. Nice to meet you. Hi, Anne. Nice to meet you too. What do you study here? I'm studying biology. And what's your subject? It's engineering. And my name is Linda. Hi, Linda. What are you studying here? I'm studying arts. Oh, that sounds interesting. Shirley and Linda are from the UK. Oh, where are you from in the UK? I'm from Edinburgh. And I come from Leeds. Unit 2 Numbers Part 1 Cardinals The numbers used to count the objects in a group are called cardinal numbers. 1, 2, 3, etc. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 21, 32, 43, 54, 65, 76, 87, 98, 99. Exercise 1. Reading the numbers. Please read these numbers after me. 13, 18, 7, 20, 23, 31, 54, 39, 71, 14, 40, 58, 60, 67, 85, 97. Exercise 2. Number Dictation. Listen to the following numbers and write them down. 14, 17, 21, 24, 26, 35, 49, 55, 98, 42, 66, 73, 88, 57. Exercise 3. Ticking the numbers you hear. You will hear someone reading the numbers in the box. Some of them are correct and some are not. When the number is correct, put a tick by it. If it's wrong, put a cross. Look at the box below and listen to the tape. 5 63 99 40 27 52 36 11 74 52 93 60 19 88 12 26 35 43 78 77 49 Exercise 4 Which number is it? Listen to Exercise 4 on the tape. When you hear a number that is in the box, draw a cross next to the number. One of the numbers in the box is not on the tape. Which number is it? Now listen to the following numbers. 6 96 49 11 13 76 19 18 
57, 83, 24, 75, 64, 51, 25, 33, 22, 91. Exercise 5. The Number Practice. Listen carefully and write the number in the blank. Write the numbers in figures, not words. Number 1. The sweater costs 46 pounds. Number 2. Tom bought 13 books yesterday. Number 3. Mary is 26 years old. Number 4. Janet was 40 minutes late. Number 5. There are 29 students in my class. Number 6. My grandfather has 18 grandchildren. Number 7. Bill wears size 43. Number 8. The temperature was 38 degrees Celsius yesterday. Number 9. The train arrived at 12 o'clock. Number 10. I got 87 on my English test. Exercise 6. Discriminating between teens and tens. The teen numbers, those between 13 and 19, are often confused with the multiples of 10, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, and 90. This lesson is for practice in hearing the differences in the following pairs of numbers. 13, 30, 14, 40, 15, 50, 16, 60, 17, 70, 18, 80, 19, 90. It is important to listen to the last part of each word. Listen carefully. Be ready to write. Draw a circle around the correct number. Number 1. The student from New York bought 15 new books last week. Number 2. My Uncle George lives at 30 Kings Road. Number 3. Mr. Johnson was 14 minutes late for his lecture. Number 4. It took 16 hours to finish his work. Number 5. Mary finished the test in 70 minutes. Number 6. My friend Alan lost 19 pounds the first day of class. Number 7. I paid 80 pounds for that coat. Number 8. He lives at 5062 Green Street, York. Number 9. Her address is 1340 Farm Street, Brighton. Number 10. We bought 40 CDs last month. Exercise 7. Reading the numbers. Please read these numbers after me. 201 324 109 414 240 634 523 744 599 717 Exercise 8 Number Dictation Now listen to the following numbers and write them down. 314 207 145 213 478 523 196 
629. 229. 155. 816. 960. 960. Circulation of British Newspapers Listen to the recording and write down the numbers in the correct column. You are going to hear about the circulation for some national newspapers in Britain in 1994. The circulation of The Observer from February to July in 1994 was 495,483. The independent circulation was 275,447. The Guardian was 400,856, and the Financial Times circulation was 296,634. The circulation of the Sunday Express was 1,544,404, and the Daily Express was 1,358,246. Britain's most popular papers were The Sun and The Daily Mirror. The circulation of The Sun was 4,101,988, and The Daily Mirror was 2,496,076. Probably.